Want a license to hunt drones? This Colorado town might give you one vertical bracket time.com. Skip to content. Time. Newsfeed. Sections. Home Newsfeed US. Politics World Business Tech Health Science Entertainment Style Opinion Photos Magazine Video Life.com List Sports. Search. Search time. Follow. Facebook. Twitter. Google Plus. Tumblr. RSS. Apps. Trending Now. Late Night Laughs. Jane Adams Google Doodle. Millipedes possibly responsible for train crash. Record crowds at Burning Man 2013. Reporters' confessions get her fired. Bizarre. Want a license to hunt drones? This Colorado town just might give you one. The Federal Aviation Administration is not pleased. By Matt Peckham at M A T T P E C K H A M S E P T. Zero six twenty thousand one hundred thirty. Share. Read later. Send to Kindle. Carlo Allegri, Reuters a small drone helicopter operated by a paparazzi record singer Ben Smalls Carter, not seen, as she rides the cyclone roller coaster, while filming a music video in Coney Island in New York August 29th, 2013. Related. Drone strikes in Ottawa watch, dramatic drone footage off Costa Concordia drone delivers flying sushi burgers at London restaurant. Email. Print. Share. Facebook Twitter Tumblr LinkedIn stumble upon Reddit Digbix delicious Google Plus. Comment. Follow at T I M P N D W S F E D D. Things you can hunt that begin with the letter D for two hundred dollars. Alex, ducks, cheer, doves ellipsis point strong. If the residents of a small Colorado town about an hour east of Denver vote to make it so next month, then yep, drones, too. Watch, snake found in Starbucks toilet. Tear trail, Colorado residents are already lining up for permits, reports Reuters, apparently keen to blast unmanned aerial vehicles out of the sky. Town clerk Kim Oldfield said the whole thing started when resident Philip Steele, who worried that the country is becoming a surveillance society, pitched the idea of issuing permits to hunt drones as a way to protest their rise, hypothetically anyway, in the national scene. That led town trustees to decide last month that the question warranted a public vote. And once the decision to put it to a vote was reached, applications for the $25 permits began pouring in and dash not just from Deer Trail residents, says Oldfield, but everywhere, including a few from folks living in the UK and Canada. I stopped counting when it hit 985, Oldfield told Reuters. Deer Trail's population was 546 as of the 2010 census. Not that anyone's looking to pick off a bunch of unmanned vehicles, says Oldfield, noting that those in favor of the drone hunting permits want to stage a contest and basically a skeet shoot using drones in lieu of clay discs and dash which could promote tourism and allow the city to reap a little extra revenue. Still, the Federal Aviation Administration isn't amused, issuing a note last summer when the ball started rolling pretty much warning people to keep their weapons holstered, if a drone happens by, permit or no point, a shooting at an unmanned aircraft could result in criminal or civil liability, just as would firing at a manned airplane, said the government agency. More, a New Mexico clinic to offer Breaking Bad Rehab scholarships. Mad Peckham at M A T T P E C K H A M. Mad Peckham is Times Video Games, science tech and music tech correspondent based in Ann Arbor, Michigan. His work has appeared in Variety, The Washington Post, The New York Times and others. Three comments. Get live a fire. Fact. Sign in. Plus follow. Post comment. Link. Newest vertical bracket oldest. Denmark's 5 BTS. Point a euro shooting at an unmanned aircraft could result in criminal or civil liability, just as would firing at a manned airplane, a euro said the government agency. What else would you expect from a government that accepts corporations as people? Skydoing 5 BTS. Will they also issue permits to 